Okay, so you're gonna see a video of the, the actual basket. This is not the same basket, it's very similar. You can see this basket is toasted to bearing. We've got debris here, and we've got a lot of slop here. This is definitely noticeable slop. There's a difference between the shock absorber uh, action and the bearing slop. You can usually hear a noise when you hear the bearing slop. Uh, anyway, we had a real devil of a time trying to get that nut off for that pulley. You have to have you have to pull that pulley, the back pulley off, in order to separate the two halves of this uh, this tub, in order to slide the whole thing out to replace the bearing. And so, the basket that I will show you here in a minute is a basket that is from a Frigidaire Affinity, and the nut was an Ellenhead nut, and uh, we're going to replace it with a regular nut because the Ellenhead would not come off. Supposedly, the Ellenhead was driven in with a machine a robot, and apparently they didn't to uh, set the torque very uh, correct because it stripped out the uh, Ellen head uh, screw and so we had to drill it out and you'll see how we did that. Dun, dun, dun. 
it. Now that thing, just warning, you know, it, supposedly when you take the pressure off the cap, then it's a lot easier, but that thing, I could not, it stripped out the Allen head when I, you know what right. I'm saying? So yeah. don't bust your... No, no. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Yeah, it was the fucking, the heat in the deep creep, man. I knew that would do it. Once the deep creep went, I was like, yes, because I got it to bubble. You see the rust right there? Watch, right there. Yeah, that's, right. that's what was fucking holding it. Uh. It would not bubble there for like five minutes. I was heating it and I was heating it at all sides and it just wouldn't bubble and finally I'm like, fuck. And I just started heating that side and just kept doing it, kept doing it, kept doing it, and kept doing it, kept doing it. And sprayed it with deep creep and it sat there in a puddle. And I just walked away. And when this cooled off, this shrank. Uh huh. Stainless and steel oh, uh -huh. expand at different rates. So this expanded faster than this did. And then this just kind of went uh, and stopped. And this one shrank. And that's when it just. Hmm. Ooh, that's pretty, man. Let me blast it with some air. You got a sample okay. right there.